your self-service, you always want to have an immediate out for customers, right? Okay. Immediate. Like if they, you know, some examples of self-service that we have is we have um, what we just call internally forms, right? And so a customer okay. can use, a, do a return form or a warranty form and it will walk them through everything they need for that process. But at any point, if a customer's like, nope, I'm out, I want to talk to somebody, they can reach us. We're not, there's no barriers to getting back in contact with live agents. So that's what I would say. It was like, as you're putting it together, always have that out, always have that ability for a customer to reach a live agent, even if it's an email, right? Like if you're not an always on company mm -hmm. and they reach a barrier in the self-service, have an option to be like, Hey, send us an email. We'll get back to you in this time frame. Don't, you don't want customers to feel trapped in your self-service that you want them to feel truly like it's a benefit. Right. Um, and sometimes it, they can be set up as traps and customers get very frustrated by that. 